Assalamualaikum. Welcome to this video tutorial on ASP.NET 4.5 for students of King Faisal University and for others who want to learn ASP.NET. This is part 1 in this series entitled Acquiring and Installing ASP.NET 4.5. There are several IDEs available for ASP.NET, but the best way of getting the IDE as of this recording is either by installing Visual Studio 2012 or Visual Studio Express 2012 for web. Visual Studio 2012 is a successor to Visual Studio 2010 and is a commercial product from Microsoft with capabilities other than web applications. Visual Studio Express 2012 for web, on the other hand, is freeware and is the successor to Visual Web Development Express 2010. To get the Visual Studio Express 2012 for web, you can simply go to this link which can also be found below this video. When you are already in the download site, scroll down till you find Visual Studio Express 2012 for web. There are two ways of installing it. Either you use the install now or the download now. I suggest that you use the download now. After which, you will be guided with steps to install it. Alhamdulillah, and it's very good news for KFP people. Our university is part of Microsoft's DreamSpark program that gives KFP students and staff free access to most of Microsoft software for learning, teaching, and research purposes. With this, we will acquire and install Visual Studio 2012 instead. Please visit these links for you to use your guide and the application form. This is a sample application form from the college. You have to fill all this up. Once done, you have to send it to Sir Nur Saman. Make sure you attach it, identify yourself, and tell him that you are requesting for the code. Then you have to wait for his answer and the code. Once you've received your account from Sir Nur Saman, go to dreamspark.com for creating an account. Type your email address. Assign at kfu.edu.sa. Retype it. Assign at kfu.edu.sa. Select your preferred language or country is Saudi Arabia. Your password should be at least six characters and one of them should be special like at sign or found sign. Then click continue to verify. It will not be verified. So select I have a verification code, the one that you got from Sir Nur Salman. Supply those codes here and click verify. Once verified, you can now log into DreamSpark with your account. Okay, this is the address for you to sign in. Or you just go to DreamSpark and click sign in. I will use my real account. This is Okay, you saw my password. Sign in. Once it's verified, you will see this message. You have successfully created a verified DreamSpark account. So to download the software, you click number two. Go to the so student software catalog. And now here, you can see all the software that you can download. Here are the developer and designer tools, the servers and application and some training and certification. We're interested with Visual Studio Professional, so I will click Visual Studio Professional 2012. Have to wait. Okay, so download now. Select a product version. Select 32-bit, and then click the download button. After the downloading is completed, go back to the software catalog and select Visual Studio 2012 update. This is the first update as of now. Just select the language, Multilingua, and again click the download button. Go to your downloads folder to see the files that you've recently downloaded. Here is the update and the Studio Professional. Right click this Visual Studio Professional and extract it. Once extracted, we are now ready to install Visual Studio 2012. Double click the extracted folder. Double click BS Professional. 
click I agree and then next select all and install if installation requires you to restart your system just simply comply and restart it and it will automatically continue after restart once Visual Studio 2012 completes installation you may launch it or not but I suggest not yet instead go back to the downloads folder and double click the update again this will take a little time click I agree and install Now that your Visual Studio 2012 and its update have been installed, we can proceed to the next tutorial for our first ASP.NET website. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Masalama.